What do you stand for? In an age where so many seem to be bowing down and giving in to a culture of ungodliness, Christians should be willing to stand up for God and for biblical principles. But if you think this problem is only unique to us because of the times in which we live, you are wrong. From the beginning of time, God has called on his people to stand up for truth and not bend under cultural pressure. Welcome to the Hall of Prophecy. In this place, we can rediscover and witness the strength and courage of three Hebrew young men who would not bend a knee to a false god. Because of their faith, these three men were elevated to a place of prominence in Babylon. Respected, admired, revered, these exiles lived for God even in an unfamiliar land, a strange and godless culture ridden with sorcery, witchcraft, and carnality. And when they would not bow, they were to be burned. So the three courageous Hebrews stood and stood again, and then another stood with them. When it was all said and done, in standing for God, they changed the world around them. So who are these three fireproof men who took a stand and would not bend a knee to a false god? Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, the firemen, agents of Babylon. <laughs> 